Why, hello there. I am Dr. Steve. Do you realize that when you go to sleep, your body is unused for eight whole hours? You keep your body for yourself for a whole eight hours, even when you don't really need it. How selfish of you. Think of the public good of the community. That's why you should loan your body to science at night for medical research. If you loan your body to science, all that will happen is that scientists will come to your bedroom some nights while you're sleeping and perform non-invasive medical experiments to further medical knowledge. For example, let's take this community-minded woman who agreed to loan her body out to science. There's a whole wide range of experiments that we can perform that will further scientific knowledge. For example, we can perform tests to measure foot flexibility. Hmm, surprising flexibility. I'll have to write a journal article about this one. We can also test knees for bone density. Hmm, this popcorn didn't budge when I pressed it against her knees. That must mean that her bone density must be denser than popcorn. What an amazing discovery. Now let's try something with a different density, like an egg. Her knee is also more dense than this egg. What an amazing discovery. We can also test the subject reaction to external stimuli, such as moisture. Mmm, surfing. What an amazing discovery. We can also use this time to test for allergies. Achoo, achoo. Another thing we can do is amputate an arm and replace it with a robot arm. We can test it out, and then once we're done, we can then reconnect the original arm. Isn't this fascinating? We can also perform psychological experiments. You like Steve's videos. Must watch more. Must watch more. And that's it. The subject wakes up in the morning, totally refreshed, and has done something good for science. Why, hello there. How was your sleep? It was fine, it, except I have this sudden urge to watch all of your videos. Wind them up, wind them up. I want to see them now, now, now.